Hello, Pisces Nation. <clears throat> I am Phoenix Rising, and if you're new to my channel, thanks for watching. Um, and if you're a subscriber, thanks for watching as well. Either way, I'm very humble and thankful you're here. I am here to deliver your career reading for the month of May. Um, I've already did your pre-shuffle and I have your cards ready. Um, this is just a regular spread, general, for your uh, career. This is the main card. And this is a, your last card I asked Spirit to give me to give you like direct messages. That's the main messages. But these are messages as well. But this is the last card. <clears throat> and you get to ask me a question. Well, ask the deck a question. And or spirit and I'll flip the card at the end and the card will uh, tell you your answer about your career um like I don't want you to ask me should you quit or anything but maybe should you apply for something that's why I said lightweight because you need a reading to get any deeper than that okay so like should you apply for the job is this job for you you can ask stuff like that okay okay Pisces so let's get started with your reading you got the eight of swords in reverse this is trapped in a career or a current job or position. It's like feeling powerless, um, hopeless, helpless. To improve your situation at the moment, you're the master of your own destiny. And that's why this card is here. This is the master of your own destiny card. Um, if you hate your current job or the situation that much, you need to do something about it. You have the power to change it. This is trapped or restricted. And that's why you're tied up. <clears throat> By current money situations, too, status for some of you. Um, it's like, yeah, trapped, like anxiety. Trapped, yeah, trapped or like due to, the, due to anxiety. It's not a reality, though. It is something you're making up in your head. <clears throat> it's not the reality of the situation. This is like, um, get creative. Think outside the box. If you want to make more money, there's a way to do that. There's a way to get to what you want. So don't give in to fear, because this is fear. This is pressure, anxiety, drama, dilemma, all those type of feelings. Feeling trapped, imprisonment in your head. Negative attitude, hands tied, helpless or hopeless for some of you. With that came the Queen of Swords. This is an older woman at your job, maybe, or in your life, that's going to offer support, assistance, or like some type of constructive criticism about your career. Um, she'll be honest and wise and professional. Um, follow her example is what Spirit wants you to do. She could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. Good communication skills. Um, they don't have to be that sign, but they can be. Um, they have good communication skills, though. Able to get their point across to colleagues with respect. This can also be you. Wit, honest, integrity, um, like solid money advice. It's, this card is about you paying attention, is what this card means. If it is a woman, she won't um, send you in the wrong direction. This is um, fair, honest, truth, intelligence, a problem solver. Okay, and most of all, this is um, your mouthpiece. This is about using, that's why I said for some of you, it's you. It says, um, basically, Spirit says, use your mouthpiece. Your mouthpiece leads you to some good money advice and opportunities. Your mouthpiece, that's why I named the reading what I named it. The gift of gab, because that's what you have. Oh, these little butterfingers of mine. <laughs> you got the Knight of Cups in reverse. For some of you, this is bad news or a missed opportunity that you know about or that is coming. We don't want you to miss it. This is um, the missed opportunity is through you procrastinating. You're taking too long. Or it's a revoked or withdrawn offer for a job, career, or a business. Waiting on news about a job or a course, like an application, the offer fails through unsuccessfully. It might have already happened or it's going to happen for some of you. It's um, like losing or leaving a job for some of you too. It doesn't have to be, you know, it could be you either going, you've lost a job currently or you're leaving your job. This is underhanded deals and frauds for some of you at the job. Gullible in business. This could be you being gullible, so be careful. Extortion, 
illegal activity, okay? And this is also a creative block. It doesn't have to be that deep. It could be just a creative block. Check all facts before rushing in um, any job. This is like stifling your creative talent. This is also avoiding money issues, like a missed chance to increase wealth or financial guidance. Lucrative offers falling through. Or you're you're not like as good. You're not as good as you as you like you're um second guessing yourself. But this also is like look do research before you spend your money. <laughs> do your research. Take your time. You got the Hierophant for your next card at the lead. This is a group or a team project. Um, this basically says do what it's, what's expected of you. To avoid like um, unconventional methods at work. Don't do more. Do, do what you're supposed to do. That means don't add on. You'll be successful with that. Even if you feel like you want to be creative at work, if it's not allowed, don't do it. This is teacher or mentor that um, helps you on your career path. So... You got double confirmation of someone coming to help. On your career path. Or this is you may become a mentor or a trainer. So that still could be your double confirmation for you as far as what you need to be doing. Something out of the box and creative. <clears throat> this is taking up study or education. This is institution. Some of you going back to school. Picking up school or like doing something with school. <clears throat> I, I'm getting nursing too for somebody. Doctor, nursing, cooking, chef. Um, this is look look at the wrist. Fashion too. And here. Um, look at the wrist. Conventional investments basically. Stick to regular methods to manage your money. Reach out to like institutions for knowledge and sharing. That means do your research with the Hierophant. It can happen. You just got to do what you need to do. The Eight of Wands is in reverse. This is like things taking off too fast or not fast enough. It's either or. It's like a zero to a hundred for somebody. Or it's some of you Pisces are at a zero and some are at a complete hundred. This is overseas or state or country like meeting canceled. A conference canceled overseas or a country or state. Or a city. Career not, it's like a career not progressing in the way you thought it would, right? So it's like setbacks, cutbacks, cutbacks at work. Lack of opportunity or promotion. This is also career taking off so fast and rapid you can't even keep up for some of you. It's like the workload is, is so struggling and the or it like it's too much. It's a lot. Or this is like a business venture um, failing to take off. Or taking off too slowly for some of you. It's like so much interest you can't even um, keep up with the demands. Poor timing, missed opportunity. This is also waiting too long to take action. Procrastinate. <clears throat> Don't procrastinate, Pisces. Get busy. Got the seven of cups. This means a whole lot of options. And if you if you look at the card, all the options are not good. You got a snake, a head, but then you got some good stuff. Like I think it's that crystals and a woman. This could be the woman still. Mm, yeah, this could be the woman we were talking about. She could be coming up again. Yep. I'm sorry. I'm looking at it. It's a dragon. So it's like you got to do your research because you can get got. This is trapped in a career or job where opportunity for advancements are restricted. Feeling like you missed out on an opportunity, on a perfect job or position because of the past, you weren't focused enough. Don't worry about what you've missed out on. Take proactive steps to create an opportunity now, for the now. Feeling more uh, decisive is this card about financial matters. Clarity coming. It's like um, reality. Poor choices or, or poor, um, yeah, poor choices, opportunities or options. I need you to really look at that. <clears throat> Don't forget about your question because I'm almost going to flip the card. The last card at the, the end of your read that's very important is the King of Wands. 
This could be a Aries, Sagittarius, or a Leo that will help you. That is a man. It may not have to be. This could also mean gaining knowledge or wisdom to know that you have to think, think things thoroughly, properly before you act. It's like um, no one to hang back. You know, no one to chill. <clears throat> Confidence and leadership skills. Um, you need to. You may already be like a mentor or a boss or a leader for some of you. This is what this card means. If you start up business, it will thrive. Okay, but take your time and do your research. This is an older man, like I said, over thirty-five. That will help you advance at your career. This is business or job that help you advance in it. Building an enterprise and controlling good and it just, it'll come out good. This is managing money, and this is like a born leader. And this is um, a way with words again. You got a way with words, and then you got um, using your mouthpiece <laughs> as double confirmation. So this is letting you know. And this could be you and your spouse is what I'm picking up for some of you. Um, this could be you, and this could be him. So it just depends um, on how this could be you. Both of these could be you, the feelings that you're picking up. As far as being the mouthpiece that, like I said, leads you to a uh, money advancement with this opportunity. And then you got the um, away with words. Someone's going to like how you talk to him. And for your answer to your question, you got use your intuition, Pisces. Which is like the greatest thing about you, right? Your freaking intuition. It's always on point unless someone throws you off. You're very spiritually guided. So that's what you need to do. Um, I did love for you guys for single and for couples. You can go in my library if you didn't check that out. If you're new to my channel, you can go check that out. Um, and I did general a couple weeks ago. It'll be time pretty soon. So I usually do couples, singles, general, and career for right now. Okay? And this has been your career spread. I hope I've been some type of help to you guys. Click like, subscribe. Come back and see me again, Pisces. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Phoenix Rising. Bye-bye.